Hey folks, this is Dave with Dagon Laser Craft. I'd looked online for information on how to properly clean the X-Tool 40 watt uh, D1 laser head lens cover. And I couldn't find any information. It may be out there, but I couldn't find it. There's information on the 10 watt and the 20 watt, when it seemed quite a bit more complicated than this one. Uh, with this one, it's actually pretty easy. Make sure your equipment's off first and then remove the laser head from the carriage and it's just got this little cap over the end of the lens you just want to take that off I don't know if you can see up in there but it's pretty dingy so is the uh, projector cover for the crosshairs I know some people use uh, acetone but I've been using alcohol, I've seen other people do it, it works pretty good. I've got a couple of lasers, a M1 and this 40 watt, and then some leftover parts from a 10 watt that I had before I extended this out and added the 40. Uh, thinking about making that into a dedicated rotary machine at some point. Uh, when you clean, you want to use a side-to-side, -side, up and down motion with the Q-tip. You don't want to go in a circle because you'll just spin the lens and not get much cleaning done. So just side-to-side, -side, up and down. Clean it real good. Dry it out. Do the same thing for this projector cover for the crosshairs. Clean it up pretty good. Dry it off. Clean out this dirty lens cap. Get all the grunge out of there. And then just screw it back on. Now, if and when I have to change the lens, I have to take these hex screws out and, and pull this whole cover off here. I'm getting a little concerned about the, the residue buildup in the fan, so I may do a video later taking this apart and cleaning that out pretty good. Uh, but other than that, that's it for cleaning the lens cover. I uh, appreciate you folks watching. I'd appreciate it if you would like and subscribe. And we'll see you on the next video. Thanks.